Oh my gosh, what is going on with the thing? I, I have no clue. Maybe it's just the time. Happy Halloween, everyone. Oh my gosh, why is it? Oh, this is horrible. I should just restart all over again. This is, yeah. You know what? This, this is what happens, you know? I just, I get so excited about coming in here and finding spook trees that just, it blows me away that I, I got the wrong axe in my hand. I, you know what? Fans are here. Fans are here and they're amazing. They are awesome because I love them so much. And these guys are like, oh my gosh, good from it. I just watched one of your videos. You're so cool. Can we have screen these? I was like, yes. Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, please hit that subscribe button. Please. I, I need your subscriptions. I, it's up to you. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. Don't forget to hit the like button. Again, just your choice. It's a call out that I'm supposed to be doing, but you know what? Everybody else is ask, acting like really desperate for them and stuff, so I might as well too. I'm, oh, please, please give me your subscriptions. <laughs> Sorry, I can't, I can't do that. If you want to subscribe, it's completely your choice and no one can ever make you or force you to do anything that you don't want to do. Okay? Okay, cool. As long as we all have that, uh, Understanding. I didn't say okay, Google. Never mind. Thank you. At least Google understands me. It's like, okay, not bad. <clears throat> Let's see here. What was I doing? I need. Here. I'm going to need one of these right here. Let's go ahead and pull that out. B. Pick that up. I don't want to take the gingerbread with me. Well, you know what? It can come with. It can come with, and, and we'll, we'll be fine with it. Uh, I need a glass door. Now, somebody showed me um, that you can actually take... Uh, is this palm? This is probably palm. I don't know what this is. You can actually take and lower this Y-axis all the way down like that and do like a, like a 2.4 or something like that, and then you just drop these in. And it will work. It planks them out to be uh, about the right size for flying. Do, 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 do. I never thought I'd end up in your lobby. <laughs> All right, so this one it, it should be long enough that we could fly with it. Let's uh, let's try. I've not done this yet, so here we go. Oop. And out. Oop. There we go. Okay, so we're flying with birch wood. That works. It is a little glitchy, but that's because it's a little bit thicker than the uh, the other stuff. Okay, we are looking for spookwood. By the way, those of you asking about my eyeball, it is hurting really bad. And it's all red, and I can't see out of it. Um, hopefully it gets back to normal. It, sh it should be going back to normal within the week sometime. I don't see any spookwood. I don't see any spook wood. Is it somewhere where I should have seen? Like all the rest of the trees? In a normal place. So this is actually a lot cheaper than um, purchasing $550 worth of glass just so you can fly around. Code, oh my gosh. <laughs> Hi. Hello, Slick Mills. So let's head over to the uh, the icy area because that's that's the one area I usually check. And if I drop right now, well, right about now, we should be on top of the. Oh gosh. Oh, it was just barely off. Dang it. Okay, hold on. Come here, come here. Wee. You know, one could say I am a uh, a witch flying on my broomstick. Just saying. Catch the references there. See? <clears throat> Sorry. That's from uh, <laughs> Wizard of Oz. I don't know how many of you have watched Wizard of Oz. Ooh, that's a classic. <laughs> I know you're probably flying right now, but can you sign my base? Oh. <laughs> maybe. I'm going to give you a maybe because I am kind of pressed for time tonight. Uh, I am building something. And I want to get it released for uh, for October, which I didn't start in on until Tuesday. 
and Tuesday is when I actually started building it. But it's it's already it's come along like pretty far so far. I'm I am thoroughly whoa thoroughly impressed with the the progress so far. Alright, let's just grab this. Go off to the side. Do 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 we always forget how much time it takes to go searching for spookwood, and we could have gone the wrong way. I mean, we might not find it until the very end, and you know what? This server might not even have some. We don't know. Oh gosh, come on, come on. What's going on here? There we go. It did not like the first person stuff. <laughs> so I can, I can pretty much tell you that that's not on the front side over here. There's no spook wood. But we're going to keep searching. We'll search high and low. All throughout the wilderness. Trying to find the spook wood. I wonder if it grows inside the cabin. Has anybody ever seen it inside the cabin? That's a question for the times. That's, that's a new times question. Is it just me or am I seeing like little dots over the place? That's probably just my eye. Probably just my eye. Playing tricks on me once again. Uh, is my headphones... My headphones are not green. Somebody was saying, hey, green headphones the other day. They're not... Oh, is that... Oh, I think it might just be a dead tree. Let's not get our hopes up. Just yet. Mm, is it going to disappear? It's probably going to disappear. You know what? Let's go down. Yeah, it was a dead tree. Dead tree. Doesn't count. Doo -doo. Flying around. Like a witch on Halloween. Spooky, scary skeletons. <clears throat> now, am I going to lose my piece of wood on the uh, snow? <gasps> no. Oh, there it is. Grab. Oh, uh, grab. And, uh oh, where'd it go? All right, it's right next to me. Grab. There we go. Oh, come on, buddy. There we go. <laughs> it's just spinning around me. Oh, gosh. Where did you go? Okay. Can I see it through the... I cannot see it through the snow. Strange. What strange and wondrous tales we have to tell. Okay. Maybe it's just too... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Dang it. Come on. Get up there. We, we can get up there. We, we got this. We got this. Please. Just... It's so close. Uh, it's just out of reach. Okay, let's go. Over here is there, is there a little... Oh, here we go. This is a good spot. Jump. Drop it down. There we go. And jump. Whee! I'm sailing away. So climb aboard. <clears throat> Sorry. I don't know what's come over me. I'm wanting to sing 70s and 80s songs. 70s songs. No, don't do it, Code. You've got too much to live for. <laughs> you know, I've always kind of wondered, like, what was under this mountain? You know? If we could figure out a way to go downward. Uh, not like that. Just, like, actual down... Downward. Hmm. Hold on. Is the... Oh! No! No! Okay, we're right on the edge. That's okay. We, we have axes on us, so... In the event that we do fall down, we still have ways of getting up places. Not efficiently. And definitely not as easy as this. But we do have our ways, don't we? Now, I wonder if he's hidden anything inside... Oh, gosh! My goodness. Why is it so unstable today? Okay. 
I don't think it likes first person. Maybe maybe it just doesn't like first person. Let's go inside here. Take a quick pick a peek a roo. Because that's what we do. We myth bust and stuff. It's kinda like I got rhymes. Not really. I don't see any trees. I see trees a spook inside the caves. Lighthouse model from back in the days. And I think to myself, what a wonderful October. <clears throat> I, was, I was trying for a, a Louis Armstrong impression right there, if you didn't know. Uh, Louis Armstrong played the trumpet back in the black and white era before color television and stuff. He had this, this trumpet. This, this, it was just this a beautiful sound. If you don't know him, um, do a Google search after after you're done watching my video. Um, go check out. Oh gosh, hold on. Go check out YouTube and um, look up Louis Armstrong. Um, he was also featured in um, the Fallout for all you Fallout fans. Um, let's see. I think it was Fallout Two. Maybe it was um, a kiss to build a dream on by Louis Armstrong. Give me a kiss to build a dream on. And then there was a there was another one for the Brotherhood of Steel. Um, I think that was on the original Xbox, and that was Nuclear Blast. That was a pretty good song too. Uh, okay, you know what? My headphones are like bugging me so bad right now because of the weirdness that they've got going on. Hold on, where is Logitech Real? Go to the filters, chroma color, correction. That one. No. Wait, where is it? We're on. We're on Roblox. Where's that one? Oh, video capture device. There we go. Filters. Hit that chroma filter. We're just gonna turn that down. Turn that low. Oh gosh. Like that a little bit. They don't even look golden anymore. They look like a gray color. I trust me, they're they're like super gold. Watch, watch. See, they're super yellowy gold. But I guess it's it's close enough to the color of the background that it's I don't know. Maybe I should do like a custom color. Hold on. Is there a way to do Custom, yeah, that's a, like a super green color. I want, I want like a yellowish green color. Maybe a little darker. Maybe a little less yellowy. Hold on, can I do a dropper? Is there a way to do droppers? That's, that's not the color. It is more greenish. It's like a lime green. Oh, that's that's close. That's super close. Okay, do that. Oh no, that's like horrible on my headphone. Oh my gosh! No, well, that's kind of cool. I... <laughs> okay, no, no. Let's go. Let's go back. We had it. We had it good. We we were good. No custom colors. Let's just go green. And there we go. Take out that. And then my headphones. You know what? They don't need the smoothness. The smoothness. Kind of makes it fade a little bit. There we go. That's that's good. That's well. That's that's Manuel. Manuel, thanks for the picture code. I have to go now. Bye, dude. I'm so sorry. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention to the people. Bye. Sorry, I can't type. I'm flying. ATM. <laughs> Do I remember Keegan? I think so. I think I remember Keegan. Let's go flying. Come with me and you'll be in a world of lumber imagination. Fly on logs. Look for spook. 
It is our nation. Hi to Christine and Chris Jordan. Big ol' smiley face from JJ024ever. Keegan20716 says hi, Slick. <laughs> Sorry, I just, I just went with it. And I, I love it. It's so good. Maybe I need some coffee. This is the ADHD. You can tell that I have ADHD and not the ADD, which is the attention deficit disorder. I have the attention deficit hyper disorder with the H. Mm. By the way, I am also still taking my Wellbutrin to kind of manage my ADHD, but I've also found out that I have been able to manage it so when i don't want to concentrate i don't really have to um it does help with concentration on work and with paying attention to conversations and hi girly says slick mills and just paying attention to things i think it's a good thing it's really good <clears throat> If you happen to have ADHD as well, don't you dare let anybody tell you that you can't do something. You have every ability that everyone else has, plus a little bit more. Okay? That's why I have the, the things that say ADHD is my superpower, because it truly is. It is a gift, and all you need to do is you need to learn how to harness it. Right now... It feels like impossible to pay attention to conversations and the normalities of what a conversation should feel like or be like. And sometimes you just don't care. Like, if I'm done with a conversation, I I will gladly tell you, you know what, I'm kind of bored. Can we talk about something else? And when it's not something that I'm interested in, forgive me, but my caring level is very low. I really don't care. Um, it's not that I don't want to care. It's that I can't. It is It is practically beyond my capabilities to understand how you would feel if I were to insult you about not caring about the thing that you were talking about. And I know that it's relatable, but a lot of people don't talk about it. It's not something that is common. It's a normality. And it's not that I don't care. It's that I don't know how to care. And I've learned how to pretend. And I've learned how to hold a conversation. But that's just it. It was learned. It was definitely nothing I could actually teach anyone it's not some something that somebody could teach me it's like everybody else knew the answer on how to act in school and they were looking to me as like well why why don't you know how to act like what's different why why are you not normal well that's why it's because i had adhd and quite frankly other things interest me um Something that you might relate to, okay? If you want to be a programmer, if you want to be a coder, okay? I encourage it. I encourage kids to go and find your passion. I encourage teenagers. I encourage other adults. If you want to go be a computer programmer, go do it, okay? Because you're going to find out real quick if you want to code and if you want to program. There is no doubt in my mind that you will figure it out real quick if you can stand the code. A lot of people will get bored with it because it's a lot of mundane and routine things that you happen to do. Um, a lot of people aren't cut out for staring at a screen for eight hours a day and writing out thousands of lines of code that translate into something that is on the screen. It's... It's an amazing feat for anyone. So from the most basic levels of Scratch to Python to C Sharp to C++, Visual Basic, HTML, Cobalt, RPG, whatever your choice of language is, if you program in it, good job. 
okay? And don't let anybody take that away from you. Um, somebody asked me today if I thought I was a good scripture. And I thought about it. I'm like, well, yeah, I'm pretty. And then I really thought about it. I'm really good. And I've... Ooh, no! I lost my word! <clears throat> I'm really good. I mean... And I doubt myself all the time. Which is something that programmers actually do. People with ADHD do the same thing. Um, when your confidence is low, you tend to listen to what other people say. Um, I know I'm humble a lot. Like, hey, I don't actually consider myself a YouTuber. I kind of do this on the side as like a hobby. But when I step back and actually think about it, yeah, I am a YouTuber. But I don't want you guys to look at me and I don't want to look at myself and be like, yeah, yeah I got 107,000 subscribers because of me. No. I am here because of you. Not because, like, <clears throat> I made it here all by myself. There's no way I could have done it by myself. It's you guys. And... <sighs> we haven't found any spook weed yet. <laughs> no! <clears throat> it is... Something to be revered, you know, but I don't want it to go to my head. I'm a YouTuber. I have made something out of my channel that the majority of YouTubers don't do. And you can do it. Don't get me wrong. You can go and record. You can record all day long. Now, whether or not somebody actually picks that up and starts watching them and subscribes to you... That's a different formula. I don't know what, what that formula is. I can tell you what I do. Every single day, record 15, 30 minute gameplays. That's what I do. Um, if you're new starting out, I highly recommend that you start editing so you can see the time that it takes to actually make good edits and everything else. Watch other YouTubers. Watch the patterns. Watch what they do. Okay, that's the fastest way to learn. Don't watch, don't watch a video, uh, a gameplay video for the gameplay video. Watch for the edits, watch for the cuts, watch for the timing. You'll notice that a lot of gameplays have so many edits that they can't hold a normal conversation. The conversation like I'm having with you right now is broken up in patterns and short. I try not to do that. Inside my videos, I am talking constantly, and that is a learned skill. Whenever I first started my videos, I did not talk all the time, but I found out that if I watched it back to myself, I got really bored, just like if I'm watching myself right now and eating lunch, because that's usually the time that I rewatch my videos. Um, hi, future me, by the way. Uh, don't forget to put your eye drops in after you get done with your lunch, okay? Cool. Um, <laughs> the the thought that goes into the camera, into the idea that somebody is watching me right now, because here's the cool thing. Um, okay, sorry. Let me finish my first thought. <clears throat> fifteen minutes a day, fifteen thirty minutes a day gameplay every single day. Don't play something that you're forced into. Play something that you want to play, like me doing lumber. Because that's probably going to become your prime element. That's going to be your main thing. Now, my channel has gone through a lot of different changes. It started out as just a like an expedition channel where you could see the different hacks that I did with um, soldering a, an Xbox controller to hook up to a USB port, stuff like that. Um, taking a Nexar, um, Nexstar, Nexar navigation unit and hacking into it because it had Windows CE on it. Little things like that. It just... It was that kind of channel. And it turned into me wanting to change the way YouTube was viewed because I got tired of my kids watching gameplay videos of people just screaming all the time. And so I started in with Minecraft and hypnosis and family friendly. Eventually I got rid of the hypnosis and I was doing bot videos and gaming videos. Well, um, the game that I started playing was Lumber Tycoon 2 and I was embarrassed that I was playing this game 
instead of going and making a bot. Well, that's when I found out Studio was open and free source and an entire uh, thing. And I ended up making videos about lumber and it blew up. Not bad. Um, well, now if I try and go and play any other game, <laughs> Roblox or not, the comment section is filled with, where's lumber? Where's lumber? Why aren't you playing lumber? Of course, if I play lumber, I get a whole bunch of comments. Why don't you play other games? Hey, go play another game. Why don't you play some Minecraft? Go play Factory uh, Factory Tycoon. So it's a it's a win lose situation. Lose lose in the comments because everybody wants you to do something else. Stop listening to them. Like listen to your comments and respond to the the people, but. Don't listen to them when they're giving you hate and don't listen to them whenever they're forcing you to try to go and do something that you don't want to do. I love Minecraft. Don't get me wrong. I would play some Minecraft. Nobody watches it and I've not really enjoyed it the last couple times. I know Jacksepticeye is doing it. I know PewDiePie is doing it. I don't care what their channels are doing and I don't care that you guys are going and watching those channels. It's okay. I understand because it's interesting. I've watched a couple myself, but that's not the point of my channel. My channel is for me to enjoy recording, enjoy my fans, enjoy just playing games. And if somebody can't appreciate that, then they can leave my channel and they have that choice. Is that the boat down there? Oh my gosh. We are definitely not across the river yet but I can't see anything down there. Oh, I'm so scared. Should I let go? No, don't let go. Don't let go, Jack! <clears throat> That's a Titanic reference. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm a look for a flying code. <laughs> Dab, he can't talk, he's flying. He can't talk, dude. Code, code, nice. <laughs> oh, I don't think, I don't think I'm in the clear yet. I should be getting closer, but I definitely feel like I should wait a little while longer. <clears throat> if you guys ever watched my uh, Palm Bridge videos, that is a long walk. I didn't realize how long of a walk it is. 28 minutes! Oh my gosh! Time just flies, doesn't it? That's one thing I wish I had a lot more of. And you'll wish that you had a lot more of it too as you get older. Or if you're already old. Uh, or older. Um, don't you kind of wish you, that you had that time back that you wasted as a kid? Not wasted. I mean, every second of my childhood was spent doing something. Even when I was going, I'm bored. I'm so bored. Why am I bored? Because that usually led to ideas and situations where I figured out something to do and I see him. <laughs> where? Where? <laughs> There, up in the sky, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's a code primate. <laughs> All right. I think I've walked far enough. Here we go. Drop. Oh, I don't think I made it. Oh no, I'm on the wrong side. No, 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 no. There's no way. No, no, I'm not gonna be able to make it. I'm not gonna make it. No, 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 no. No, you know, no, 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 I am not losing those. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. I hope I can get back in the same one. Please be slick mills. Please be slick mills. Please be slick mills. No. Jump out. Jump back in. Please be slick mills. Please be slick mills. Stay there, slick mills. I think Slick Mills is my friend, isn't he? We've done a video together, I think. No! Hold on, quick peek, quick peek. Any spook wood doesn't look like it. Okay, we're out. Okay. Let's go to friends, friends, friends and family. Friends, friends, friends. Oh, I guess if I could just go to home. 
It'll show me all the peeps up there at the top. Hold it. Bee Swarm Simulator, Milk's Place, Magnet Simulator, Lumber Tycoon 2, Tower of Hell, Test 2, Magnet Simulator, Lumen Legacy. Isn't that like the new Pokemon Go or whatever it is? Pokemon Legend, Pokemon Brick Bronze. I don't know. Slick Mill, are you not my friend? Don't see you, dude. Slick Mills, where are you? Please stay in the game so I can join. <clears throat> he's not in there. He has left the game and he's on the web page. Probably looking for me. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay, it's 31 minutes. That is more than enough time. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. A failed attempt at finding Spookwood once again. I shall continue my search off into the vast darkness of the night. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. Talk to you very soon. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out. And we'll talk to you very soon. <sighs> Outro. And just real quick, does anybody actually like purchase from Hello Juniper? I have not seen any sales from this thing. It's October. I got some hoodies on there. Um, let's let's see some sales this this month. Let's uh, here Juniper. Mm -hmm.